Hey you guys, I'm just gonna capture this morning as it is. We're a little bit rushed on time, but hello. Let's welcome back. I just wanted to bring this morning to you because we're all together for a second. <laughs> um, at least half of us, three fourths of us are. Actually, you wanna say hi? hi. Someone's still a little are your sleepy. Eyes itchy? No, she's just still sleepy. Okay, you got your lunch packed. Daddy's just gonna spend the morning with me for for a little bit, and then he gets to come to the bus stop with you, right? Yeah. Don't say hi or anything. You wanna do the dishes, Ash? Yeah. Hey, Ashley, time to do dishes. <laughs> you gotta ask it the right way. Yeah. Yeah. So Jason has um, an ultrasound scan this morning. Is this the bottom? That's so. Oh, okay. Um, he's scheduled himself one of the ultrasound scans this morning, and things are going well at work. And so he's just gonna do this scan, which is supposed to take two hours, but it never does. So then we're gonna run to Costco, just get a few things. I think we still have milk. I need more oranges and more cottage cheese. And then we might actually go to lunch together, hang out together for a bit, and then we'll come home and swap cars and go to work. Actually, it seems like we're doing, I know. I just got doing it. Come on, Ash. So, I feel like I'm getting a cold now. I had a hard time sleeping last night, but. Um, Snoring all night. I don't normally snore, so obviously I've got something going on. You snore. Okay. I do not snore. You snore like crazy. No, I don't. Hey, Ashley, we just unloaded your dishwasher. Yeah. All right, that means you got to give me an extra big kiss. Yeah. Come and do cups. Come and do cups. Oh, my battery's flashing. Hurry, come and do cups. Hurry. I can't even see you. Hurry, do your cups. Okay, oh, I'm gonna charge this battery really quick and then we'll be right with you in just a minute. So I did Ashley's hair different today. We got the buns, lift up your head, but we did cross braids. That's kind of fun, huh Ash? And it was your idea for the buns. Okay, you guys are ready for school. We're gonna take the car, so we'll just hop in the car and go over to the bus stop that way. You want to walk down? Sure. All right. Yeah. All right. You come with us in the car, and we'll walk. We'll go over there. You walk in? I'll walk with you. All right. I am sitting in my car. I actually might have mascara smudged on my eye. <laughs> um, I'm sitting in my car, waiting for Jason. He is here getting his ultrasound scan. I joked with him. So, if, if in case you haven't heard our explanation of these ultrasound scans, there's nothing wrong with him medically. We actually volunteer to do these scans. And I also need to find my wedding ring. <laughs> it's in my wallet. Um, we volunteer to do these ultrasound scans. Um, this company that we go to tests the equipment for hospitals before it can go into hospitals. So it it changes if they change software, if they need to modify it, if they need to up, you know, make it work better. Then they touch, they test the equipment on live patients or, you know, people. So they get, lar you know, every demographic, every age group, every, what men, women, my kids were in here, um, I want to say last week. Are we already at Friday? Yeah, they were in here last week. Three of them, Abby, Chelsea, and Ashley all came in last week. So they had a whole week of pediatric work that they did last week and then they called Jason to come in today um, and they we get paid for it. So the girls each earned, it's, I don't know, they'll earn like 50 to $75 for, they were only in there for a half hour. So that's pretty good money. They are gonna use that for Hawaii. That's their spending money for Hawaii. So that saves me on my budget. I don't have to put forward as much out of our family budget. For them, they can spend that how they want to. Um, but I joked with Jason today when he got, or yesterday I joked with him when he got this scan um, opportunity to come today. I was like, well, there's your shave ice budget, buddy. Because <laughs> each shave ice, I don't know if you know this, um, they're between, I mean, it's between five and eight, even $10 a shave ice. It depends on like how many extra toppings you get and how many flavors 
and how much ice comes with it. Um, but the really good ones have um, the ice cream underneath or the cream underneath and then the shave ice and multiple flavors and then they drizzle it with like um, a sauce. It's like a um, sweetened condensed milk sauce that goes on the top and then it's really good if they actually have like pineapple or fruit and mango and that kind of stuff to put on top of it. So all those, all of that adds up. And Jason is addicted to these when we go to Hawaii and I don't mind, like this is our treat. This is what we love to get. So everyone can have it whenever they want it. Um, cause we're not going to get it again. Right. <laughs> and so we spent $150 on shave ice on our last trip, $150. So I told Jason with the money he gets today, that's his shave ice budget for just himself. He can get like seven, probably seven to 10 shave ice just on coming to get the soldier sound today. So I think that he was like, done. I'm just gonna stick that money in my wallet and I'll, whenever I wanna shave ice, it won't have to come out of your budget, which is really nice to not have to account for that. That's just kind of funny. But, um, I, when he got that opportunity to come and do this scan, um, also if you're new, we have our own shoe store. We own our own business and we just hired someone new and he's been training him and, and all that kind of stuff. And so he's been worried about um, not being at work every day. So he's been working six days a week and he got this, you know, appointment today and they just said, you know what, go to your appointment, spend some time with Dana take your girls to the bus stop, go to lunch with Dana have your morning and then come up to work and then, you know, work for the rest of the day. Cause it's still like a, by the time he comes up at lunchtime, there's still like a seven hour day <laughs> he can work. And so that's what we're going to do. I just dropped him off about an hour ago. I actually thought he would be done by now cause the girl scans didn't take long at all, but, um, his is actually taking more like the full time. Then we're going to run to Costco together. We don't have to get a ton of stuff. You saw, if you didn't see, I'll put a link to our Costco haul that we just did. But I am going to make sure I'm stocked up on basics. I'm really thinking that our school district is going to shut down pretty soon. That being said, if the school district shuts down, we're going into quarantine. <laughs> we're going to stay home. We're not having friends over. I might have limited friends over if I know that their environments at home are safe and clean, you know, and they're not sick or anything. Some people we already know I can't trust <laughs> to not have my kids come over to their house if their kids are sick. So I just had to get breakfast because we ran out of the house so fast that I didn't have time to eat. So I just got some hash brown and some orange juice. I'm babbling and it's been five minutes and you don't need to hear me babble for five minutes. We're waiting for Jason because that's what you guys all love the most is when Jason is here with me. So let's wait for Jason to come back. Well, so far everything is stocked back up except for flour. Back to normal. Yeah, back to normal. Water bottles back in stock. Toilet paper back in stock, but no flour. This guy, oh, we gotta turn this off. This guy, he says to me, as we pull up to a spot like this, I just want you to see, watch your door. There's a rock over there, there's look a, down. Uh, okay, there's, there's not, there's not, there's a curb. There was, there was a rock. There's a curb, there's a curb. There's a rock. Okay, the second he says that, he totally runs the tire into the curb. It's a big tire, 20 inch rams, <laughs> rolling large. Like, I don't know how to get out of the car. And he has to comment on it every time. All right, so at Costco, we really didn't get much. I got bananas, bread, cottage cheese. What else did I get? I don't know what you got. I think that's all I got. I think I spent like under 20 bucks. It was really, really nice. And then we got um, one birthday present, two birthday presents for people. Two. Oh, yeah, yeah, two. Yeah, so can't say what those are. They may be or for, for our family, they may not be. We have two friend birthdays and then we obviously have three family birthdays coming up so we're not gonna tell you what we bought or who it's for but we're gonna he's hungry now I'm not hungry I might get a little bit of a nibble their chips are good so we're gonna go to Cafe Rio and then you're gonna go to work right you're kind of you're kind I'm of I'm okay. not in a rush I'm not in a rush you're so. not in a rush maybe I'll convince him to stay home but I'm, I don't have any big plans at home so I know you're talking about how bored you are I know at least oh. you're bored when I'm not in your life. <laughs> I, that's going to go straight to your head. Oh, shush. <laughs> All right, we just got home and I got a package. Can anyone guess with that little checker print? 
who it could be from. I actually wanted to go here on our way home, but Jason didn't want to. Ironically, I think this activity is now canceled officially. I just bought a whole bunch of sanitizers for our church activity and it literally just got canceled. Jason just told me all activities at church are canceled from now until Easter. So I've got a whole lot of <laughs> sanitizer. We'll save it. We'll do the party another time. I was only able to order five of each kind. So the website only allowed me to order one set of five of every kind. So this one is Sweet as Strawberries. And this one is probably Vanilla. What is this one? I don't know. But I've got a bunch of them. I don't even think this is it. But there's Warm Vanilla Sugar. We were just going to do like party favors for each of the women at church. And we were trying to decide what to do over the last couple weeks. Um, we were going to do like bath bombs or lotions or... I think there was something else that we were gonna get from Bath and Body Works, but we couldn't get the deal to work online because we needed a whole bunch of extra coupons, something like that. It was good for every $15 spent, so we needed like five people to order it and use their own separate coupons. That didn't work out, so I went ahead and I was like, well, given the current <laughs> virus worry these days, let's just give the gift of sanitizer, which is actually come, hard to come by. But and we just found out maybe that they're... Oh, give me no, I just told them that it's canceled. That church is canceled? Oh, church is canceled now? Well, it's not church canceled. Oh. I'll try to stay where I'm in camera here, sorry. <laughs> sorry, I didn't... I was... Either <laughs> so I'm talking just, to you or I wasn't focusing yeah, on the camera. It's fine, it's fine. Um, uh, <laughs> uh, so they're saying that they're going to cancel all church activities except going to sacrament meeting. Which is and our I'm first hour. Well, hang on. They don't know what that means. That's our first like congregation type hour block at church, and it's where we like hear all the talks and hear from our leaders and and we pass the sacrament dish around and, yeah. and each, every single person dips in and takes bread or, or so water. So it's like the one part that yeah. is the most. Why don't like, we just pass a single Kleenex around everybody and <laughs> call it good and go home? God bless. Anyway. So I don't know what I'm going to do with these now. We'll still do it. Maybe we'll just hand deliver these on everyone's porch <laughs> and just say, stay, stay safe. So we've got 60 sanitizers. I got to call my president and ask her what she wants to do now. But it means we're not in charge of a party anymore. Unfortunately, they've done all the decorations except for picking up the balloons. Luckily, it didn't cost very much. Um, actually, it probably didn't cost them anything. They just used supplies that they already had on hand. But I already did the invitations, so we're going to have to like change the date. It's probably going to be put to April right after I get back from our vacation. It's going to be a mess. Maybe we'll just won't do it at all. You're going to go to work, right? Yeah, I'm going to work. So Jason, we just got um, some letters in the mail or whatever, and it shows what my credit score is compared to his credit score. Make sure that one's showing. No, anything. it's not showing. Um, who has a higher credit score, honey? You have a higher credit score because you because pay I my bill late sometimes. <laughs> no, and and it's also because I have a bill a card in my name that has all the business expenses. So at times but, I've got twenty or thirty thousand dollars in used credit compared to yeah, your, but you pay off the credit every month. I know, but I still always am keeping the balance that high. So my my available credit ratio is not as good as yours, love. Yeah. That's as close as I'm gonna get to. You're right, honey, you have a better credit score than me. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't had a better credit score than him because the last time we bought a car 12 years ago, he put it on his credit. That's because no, no, I was no. The only one there. That was killer because he put it on his credit, bought the car, put it on his credit, like the entire car on a car loan. And then one month later, we paid the entire car off. So he got to run that credit like and jack his his credit score up. But I have my Costco credit card on my name on my credit. And even though he does business stuff on the, on his card as like on we have two Costco credit card actual physical cards so I can we can tell who is using the card if that makes sense so that he can itemize his business stuff separate from what I purchased for the family. Hope that makes sense. So I pay that card off 
every single month. There's a, there's a few that I didn't get in in time. I will I admit that. But my credit score is better than his. And he's having a hard time with that. Mine's in the 800s. And he's still in the 700s. <laughs> he's almost 800. But he's going to head to work. And we did just get official news that church stuff is starting to get canceled. We have a huge event for um, our area. It's called State Conference. And that one is on the line. I think they should cancel that for, I think that's next Sunday or the Sunday after. Stuff is starting to get real. We're on like CNN, like Washington State. They just announced Bothell School District is canceled. That was on national news. And I don't know. All right, Jace, you going to work? Yep. No telecommuting. Everyone in our neighborhood, they all work at Microsoft and Amazon and Facebook and T-Mobile and they're all on work from home. Like no one comes to the office, work from home, telecommute, and if you have traveled, you are not allowed to go to the office. We have one of our friends who traveled for work recently and they were like, you can't come to the office if you've traveled. So he's on like strict two week quarantine, not going to the office. Yeah, I was at a place this morning, and uh, I don't want to say the company or anything, but everyone, or most of their teams are on three weeks of stay-at-home and telecommute, mm -hmm. which is wild, mm -hmm. I guess. I mean, I yeah. mixed feelings about this whole thing. Okay. All right, I'm going to work. Have a good day. Go. Spread the love. <laughs> go. <laughs> I was telling him, like, should, uh, I was telling him earlier. This, like, we should start doing our videos, our coronavirus survival updates. You could probably go like crazy berserk if that No, they're right. actually limited ads. If you say coronavirus? Yeah, I've got... I'll just call it Seattle virus update. Pandemic. I don't know what words are started. I tried to take out all coronavirus tags for the last two videos that I did, and it still is deeming it as... Oh, really? Because they're here as talking. The AI oh. hears me saying coronavirus. Dude, that's such crap. They can do that, but then they can't stop like... Pedophiles. Pedophiles. I stuff. know. Are you kidding me? I know. Okay, yeah. he needs to go to work. <laughs> <laughs> he just, I told him earlier, I was like, yeah, I'm ready for you to go back to work. <laughs> this, this whole thing is politicized and affecting our business and stressing him out. And I don't blame him, but I was like, go to work. Just, I don't want to keep analyzing it and picking it apart. I'm going to work on the computer. I was going to show you what I was working on the computer, but I have a birthday present sitting on my counter. <laughs> Literally, I have to totally edit that out. Just showed you one of the presents that I got for one of our friends or kids, or I can't even say what it was. So I'm going to work here on the computer for the next couple hours and draft a, a message to, can you even see, hey ladies, <laughs> can you see that? There it is. I have good news and bad news. That is for my committee, my party committee um, at church. Uh, we are waiting for a message to, from our bishop at church to come out officially before I can send this message to them telling them, hold off on our activity. It's canceled for right now. And hopefully, not hopefully, maybe by the end of this video today, our school district will be canceled. Who knows? Don't know what's happening. All right, and just like that, it's seven o'clock, and these guys are ready for bed, kind of. But where are we going? Home to get ice cream. Yeah, it's just us, right? Daddy's home, and you're home. Kaylee's with her friends. Abby's with her friends. Well, then you should not get ice cream. Oh, too bad. Luckily, we <laughs> luckily we know it's just allergies. Right? Grab a coat. Grab a coat. And you're just tired. You've been yep, running no. and you've been doing a lot of stuff. Just at least bring it in case you get cold. Because if you're sweaty, it could make you cold. This is our hot child right there. <laughs> what did you find? Pineapple sherbet is so good. You can only have one. It's buy four and get them for two ninety nine, right? That's a lot. Yeah, I'm getting one. You're just getting one. Each girl gets one. Well, they don't get their whole. They don't get their own. 
thing? They don't get the whole thing themselves, honey. Well, then I have to buy two until we get no. to four. <laughs> no, we're just gonna choose three different kinds. What kind do you want? Strawberry. You want the strawberry one right up there? Okay, okay strawberry, and Chelsea got like mint. Soft. mint. And this one is Mama's. So which one are you getting? And this one might be online because you get all the pineapple to yourself. It's the order of the world. It is not the order of the world. <laughs> nice try though. Because, <laughs> come on, you're going to have the whole Sherba one to yourself. Sorry. They have their kinds. And you have to share with Kaylee and Abby. because we have teenage drama going on. Kaylee is out with her friends and they're having conversations that are really not going so well. I don't know why I'm whispering. They know it, but it's not going so well. So um, we're trying to convince them to come home from the park. It's 7.30, so, but it's still dark outside and they shouldn't be at the park this late at night. And guys, my hair is falling down which is a sign that we're done for the night. So take care and maybe we'll have a special vlog for you on Sunday because we don't have church. <laughs> I don't want to seem like we're excited to celebrate not having church. It's just um, from now until we get back from vacation, there's no church because they're not doing it until Easter and then taking it a week at a time. So, you know, we have Sundays open now and we're gonna spend time together as a family. Yeah, I want to do. And if the weather's I nice, to I want to go to it. the lake or go to Alki Beach, which is over in West Seattle. And Burger Master. Not yeah. on a Sunday. <laughs> Stop. He's going to like forgo all of our Sunday standards just because we're not going to church. I'm going to inform my kids that that is not the case. We can go to a beach. We can go to a waterfront. We can go for a walk or a hike. But... Our standard is that we don't eat out, we don't shop, we don't. Burger, Except for when we're. The problem is that in Hawaii, that totally <laughs> goes out the window. We usually go to church and then go to the beach and then get shave ice. And then vacations are different. Vacations are hard. Yeah. God Say good night. God doesn't exist on vacations. <laughs> he just enjoys the vacations with us. <laughs> okay, into, he's into his ice I'm cream. I'm into my ice cream. Good night. Say goodnight again. Sorry, I wasn't. Good you night, look guys. really Thanks white right watching. there. <laughs> I am pretty white. The the lighting is really bad. But that's God agreeing. Okay, with me. stop. Good night, guys. <laughs> <laughs> this hair. It needs to be done. Good night.